Corey Henderson here, Phil Pressey's former high school coach. Um, I am so excited to see what Phil has in store uh, and what Missouri has in store for Phil uh, in the near future. Um, he's now part of their staff. He had a great nine to 10 year pro career. Um, we're all proud of him, especially him being an ESD alum, but uh, really looking forward to him uh, in the future and what he has to, to offer these young kids. Yeah, and I just want to say thank you to you, Coach Corey. You know, I went to the uh, ESD, Episcopal School of Dallas, uh, class of 2010. And, you know, this was the foundation of my career. When I get a mismatch, I'm skipping with it. Boom. Into my shot. So it don't matter what move I do, I know I'm coming back into this. To, into my hesitation pull. Like, I can pull them back, boom. To the pool. This is the same right here. Same move. You throw it to him, you come back. Like all it's all the same. That's why it's important that you're able to do this footwork. Now we're just breaking it down just into a smaller format uh, so they get it right. And then it'll be more natural when you get switch the up the hands in the game situation. Switch up your hands. All fundamentals, man. All fundamentals. There you go, Cole. Here we go. Uh. Uh, he ready to get to his bag. Yeah, he wants to. <laughs> but if you look at the guys who are you know, most over efficient, here, they're the guys who are the best at the fundamentals. Not bad. Steph Curry. You know, you're Trey Young. Like, those guys are so good. But what makes them elite is that they're able to do the fundamentals at a very high level. So that's my you know, my gift back to the game, Good. to these guys, is to teach them the fundamentals. Take bits and pieces Strong. of players' games, and you create your Strong own game. game. You take some Mar, you take some Curry, and you create your oh, own player. You know, Coach Corey kind of paved the way for me to be able to, you know, touch college, touch the NBA. And, and that's why I want to coach now, because guys like him came in my life and allowed me to, you know, reach my potential. So now I'm a coach like you, and I want to give back and touch, you know, maybe a tenth as many lives as, as he's touched. So, yeah, man, just want to say thanks. It's all love, oh, man. Yeah. For sure. No, for I never, sure. I never really, I never really had a chance to say that. But you know, I, I, every coach that I've been talking to that I played for, you know, have been, you know, a part of my journey. And now I'm a coach. Now I'm still gonna be leaning on you. You know, I still, I hit you up. I ask you questions um, because you have a, you know, experience that like no other. You know, not only being, you know, a high school coach for 20 plus years but being a black high school coach at a private school, which is unlikely. And I respect that to the utmost because, you know, education is so vital to our kids, you know, future. Now that I have a son, I see what you see. So I'm appreciative of you, yeah, I and thank you. And you're doing it the right way. You keep God first. Always. And everything else will fall into place. I mean, your wife is doing a great job. Both of you guys are doing a great job with your son. And so now it's just a matter of you take it to a whole nother level. I mean, and I'm not worried. I know you're going to do great things. So I appreciate you. Yes, sir. Because you've helped me extend my career, um, winning championships and mm -hmm. putting us on the map and the whole nine. So love you. Love you too, Coach. All right, right on.